Hi everyone. Let that might interest you. Um, I'm in the pine. This is Carlos. I'm in the Pinelands. Um, and apparently a lot of sassafras, which I was just eating, grows in the Pinelands. I love sassafras. It grows, uh, I guess, on the edges of sandy, um, more acidic soil. I'm pretty sure this soil is acidic. Uh, but pretty soon, um, well, I want to say a lot of things. So I'm in this area. I drove here. Next week I will be coming carless again. Um, but I drove not far from another place that I'm rarely am, which is in Tom's River. Um, and so just something to think about is when you're in a place, uh, a lot of you do this already, but try and stack your trips together. So I was here, I drove all the way down to Tom's River. And if I just drive all the way back, it just feels wrong to me. Um, so I wanted to go to a beach and then I said, oh, the Pinelands are, I'm in the Pinelands, the very things that I uh, and many others were gathering to say protect. Pinelands Commission protect and do not allow this pipeline in. Um, that's what we're doing. I'll try and put a link to the event or something related to it. Um, but yeah, now that I'm here, I'm, um, I didn't drive that much farther to here. So I'm enjoying what it is we're trying to protect. And we definitely should protect this. I like sassafras, uh, even if you don't enjoy it. Um, finding things that are edible and learning to forage uh, does cut down on your overall food that needs to be imported from other states or other countries and uh, is really the direction that I think a lot of us need to go in and go towards to become carless. I know that uh, we've all had a, here, I'll walk while I talk so you can see a little bit. I'll try to not shake either. Getting better at this video thing, I think. Proud of myself doing all this. So, um, now I'm distracted though. All right, well, check out and be part of, and uh, you'll, f of, of the natural world that's right around you that I think we psychologically need. We wouldn't survive without it and we thrive a lot more when we're around it. Um, and it'll strengthen your resolve to defend whatever is in your local area from uh, what seems to be inevitable uh, uh, force of suburban sprawl that just plows down areas and then names them after what they killed. Uh, we, we're not gonna survive on this planet if we keep going that way. So anyways, uh, yeah, I don't know. This was just a hello. Next week I'm gonna be walking uh with with uh from parsippany all the way down to cape may which will take three weeks more or less mas o menos so we'll see um but i'm going to be doing a lot of pipeline anti-pipeline protesting as well as stopping at farms again that are doing things the right way the way that uh the only real future that we have if we're going to continue which is living locally and um yeah i had a loss of words now so since my mouth is not being used for talking, I'm going to walk on back to the sassafras and eat a little more because it's not available locally usually to me. All right. Mwah. Love you all. Thank you for watching. Bye.